Hey gamers, Sophie here and welcome to Cherry Pop Productions Gaming. If you're new here, welcome. And if you enjoy this video, consider giving us a like and subscribe. Today we're back at Toka Life World. Yay! So in today's Toka video is um kind of different and interesting. Yeah. So yeah, let's just start the chaos. Let's play Toka Life World. Yay! Before we start the chaos, we always have to go to the post office and do our weekly routine, which is getting our free gift and throwing not pack pet snippet in the trash. Oh, there. Not, not pack pet. So I'm just gonna throw this first and this. Okay, hello snippet. Alright, we're gonna open, we're gonna tap this button. Don't give me one free gift. Oh, actually, listen to me. One, two. <laughs> Only two. Wow. <laughs> it's okay. It's better than one. What's in here? What is this? Okay. This is tea. I'm not sure. What about in here? It's just clothes. Okay. I don't know what to do with this, so we're just gonna put this right here. All right. Now let's go throw snippet in the trash. Yay. So we're gonna throw you here. Okay, bye. Now we're just gonna get out of here. So today's chaos starts at... It does not start at Cherry's house or Liam's musty, dusty, crusty, rusty apartment. <laughs> today's chaos starts at this place, the school. Yay, so let's go. Let's go to school. Yay. It's weird saying yay when you're going to school, but whatever, let's go. All right, here are the iCherry gang. Not just the trio, the whole gang. <laughs> yes, including Chris, the most underrated character. So in this video, we're gonna see how the iCherry game, game, <laughs> game, game. We're gonna see how the iCherry gang perform as a teacher. Yay, even though Cherry is still in high school but who cares <laughs> wow liam just looks like a nerd he actually looks more like a student so um let's just start the chaos <laughs> isn't this fun we get to teach kids ew <laughs> why did i even agree to this i knew that this place is gonna be filled with kids why did i even agree to work here <laughs> because you want money right oh yes i do i can't wait to teach the kids about how chicken nuggets are made <laughs> i'm excited about nothing <laughs> okay and then the school bell rings oh look the bell rang that means class has started so what's the first subject um i think it's science <laughs> oh science is so easy i can teach the kids about science <laughs> what no you can't you don't even pay attention in class so okay anyways i'm gonna go inside wish me luck no <laughs> then cherry's gonna go inside <laughs> good morning class uh i am your new substitute teacher for a day <laughs> my name is uh you can call me miss cherry wait let me write it down miss cherry okay there we go. Miss, I have a question. What is it? Why are you named after a fruit? Um, uh... <laughs> Anyways, today we're gonna be learning about science. Yay! Does anyone here like science? No. What? <laughs> I don't like science. Well, that's okay. I'm gonna make you like science. Okay. Today we're gonna be learning how chicken nuggets are made. Doesn't that sound interesting and cool and fun and delicious does anyone here like chicken nuggets i do oh really wow same you're already my favorite student wait really yes okay you can go sit down okay all right so uh the first thing of how chicken nuggets are made is uh they take all the gross stuff out of the chicken that cannot be eaten and they mix it together and blend it into a nice pink paste pink like my hair. That's
that's why my hair is pink because the color of chicken nuggets is technically pink i don't think it's as pink as your hair no 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 you be quiet please i'm the teacher please pay attention uh okay anyways after that they have to make the pink paste taste yummy and delicious so to do that they put lots of chemicals all right, there we go. Uh, don't mind my handwriting. <laughs> and also, lots of salt. <laughs> Yummy salty nuggets. Yay. <laughs> uh, that sounds gross. What do you mean it's not gross? I thought you loved chicken nuggets. Oh, uh, well, uh, not anymore. But what do you mean? Okay, anyways, we're gonna continue the lesson. So after that, they shape the pink paste into nuggets and then they freeze it and then they uh and then they deliver it to the supermarkets and then i go buy it at least 30 packets <laughs> and then i go cook it in my air fryer yay <laughs> gotta be healthy <laughs> so cook it in an air fryer not an oil and then i eat it and then i swallow it and then i digest it and then i pooped out of it that's too much information. Well, that's science. Isn't science cool? Science is cool. <laughs> yeah, see? Science is so cool. So what have we learned today? That chicken nuggets are gross? No. We learned how chicken nuggets are made? No. We learned that how chicken nuggets are so, so, so delicious and yummy. And how I can make chicken nuggets into poop. Ew. All right. Uh, now I don't know what to do now. <laughs> All right. Next teacher. Bye class. So how did it go? Oh, first day was a success. All the kids enjoyed my lesson. I bet you can't beat me, Vidya. My lesson is very, very interesting. Shut up. I don't even care. Ugh. So anyways, who's next? Who's gonna be teaching the kids? Not me. Uh, I guess me. Okay, then. Just go inside. I doubt that your lesson will be better than mine. Uh, okay. <laughs> and he walks in class. Why do I feel so nervous? Uh <laughs> Hello, students. I am your new substitute teacher for a day. How many substitutes are there? I don't know. So let me introduce myself. Uh, you can call me Mr. Liam. <laughs> Or just Liam. <laughs> I don't actually care. This is the most awkward lesson ever. <laughs> so, uh, wait. What am I supposed to be teaching again? I forgot. I didn't check the schedule. It's art time now. Oh, art time. Uh, okay. <laughs> I don't know what to do. This teacher is so bad. What? What did you say? Uh, I didn't say anything. Um, okay. <laughs> So, uh, we're gonna be learning how to, uh, draw. That's it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> but Mr. Liam, I know how to draw. I don't need someone else to teach me. But I can give you some advice. Okay, so today we're gonna be learning how to, uh... I'll be right back. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I have an idea. <laughs> okay, I'm back. <laughs> today we're gonna be learning how to draw, uh, one of my favorite anime characters. Are you a weeb, Mr. Liam, uh, yes. My dad says weeps are pathetic. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, uh, well, do I look pathetic? Um, no, yes. Oh, okay. Ouch. Anyways, we're gonna be learning how to draw Yusuku Midoriya. Who's that? He's from My Hero Academia. What's that? Wow, are you really that uncultured? What? I, I didn't say anything. <laughs> Anyways, first we draw the head. First we draw this. And then we draw this. I'm not sure if I have enough space. And then we draw his hair. <laughs> um, sure, yeah. Okay, now I'm done with the hair. Now we just have to color it. Don't mind the fact that it's blue. <laughs> That's not me I'm drawing, okay? We're drawing Deku, not me. <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> this is a masterpiece. A work of art. I haven't even drawn the face yet. It looks so beautiful. <laughs> Alright, now we're gonna be drawing the face. All right, so uh, we draw his eyes. This is actually creepy. Then we draw the eyebrows. I don't know if there's any room. Let's draw the eyebrows. And then we draw the iris. Oh my gosh, this is creepy. <laughs> 
And then we draw his freckles. Yeah, this looks so cool, right, class? Are you guys even paying attention? Uh, what was the first step again? Anyways, moving on, we're gonna be drawing the nose. Then we're drawing the mouth. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> this is how you draw him. So, how did everyone do? Are you guys actually doing the assignment? Uh, what were you supposed to do again? Oh my gosh. Well, now I feel awkward now. Um, they <laughs> just erased it. How about we draw a different character? Oh no. Can we not draw anime stuff, please, teacher? Why? It, but drawing anime is fun. Um, uh, I'm just not into anime. <gasps> oh, oh, oh my gosh. Okay, oh, oh, okay then. You know what will happen now? No? You're gonna get an F. Wait, an F for what? We're not liking anime. What? <laughs> it's mandatory to like anime in my class. <laughs> but since you don't like it, I'm afraid that I have to give you an F. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I like anime now, I think. I don't even know any. Oh, <gasps> really? Uh, yes. Maybe. <laughs> you wanna go to an anime convention with me? No. But he said you like anime. I don't think my dad will allow me. <laughs> oh yeah, that's kind of weird if we go together. So anyways, what's your favorite anime? Uh, I think we should continue the class. Oh, that's a very weird anime. No, 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 that's not an anime. I'm saying that we should continue this class. Oh yeah, right, the class. I'm a teacher. I forgot that I'm teaching you kids. All right, so what anime character am I? gonna draw next anyone can guess um no i can't i can't guess oh really you guys can't guess well i'll give you a hint he used to have a tail i have no idea what you're talking about oh oh okay what about this one if he powers up his hair will turn yellow and he will scream non-stop uh i still don't know uh the anime has the word dragon in it is it how to train your dragon that's not even an anime. <laughs> you guys really can't guess? No. Well, okay then. Uh, I guess I have to draw him then. Let's just draw his head first. <laughs> there we go. Then we draw his, his hair. Alright, there we go. Now we just draw his eyes. I'm not sure if there's any room. <laughs> Let's just draw his nose. Ew. Then we draw his mouth. The ink size is too big. Alright, I'm done. Now, can you guess who this character is? Um, I I actually don't know. What? You still can't guess? Uh, yeah. But I drew him so perfectly. <laughs> I still can't guess. What? Okay, I feel offended. Uh, let me just erase my masterpiece. <laughs> okay, class is over. All right, and his name is Goku from Dragon Ball. Okay, bye. Class dismissed. <laughs> uh, hi, I'm back. So how'd it go? Terrible. I knew it. Why do you sound so proud? Why shouldn't I? Anyways, what happened? Did the class not like anime? Ha ha ha. Uh, yeah. Yes, yes, that's the reason. That's so lame. <laughs> I can't believe you're sad because of that. Wow, what a loser. <laughs> Stop it. Then Brittany said, hey, what about us? Where's our screen time? All right, I forgot about you. <laughs> Anyways, can I go next? Hey, I want to go next. I thought you don't want to teach the class. All right, I forgot. Nah, I don't want to go next. <laughs> okay, so I want to go next. Okay, then. Well, good luck, I guess. But I doubt that you're listening will be better than mine. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> and Brittany walks in. Hello, children. Um, I am your new substitute for a day. Why do we have so many substitutes? I don't know. Ask your principal. Anyways, my name is... Wait, let me write it down. My name is Brittany, but you can call me... Wait, no. You must call me. Alright, let me just write it down. I'm not sure if there is enough space. Um. Okay, there's, there's not enough space space. You can call me Mademoiselle Brittany. <laughs> what? Yeah, so start calling me that. Now I'm just gonna erase this. So today we're gonna be learning about mathematics. I know kids don't like maths, but don't worry. I'm gonna make it fun for you guys. Wow, finally we're learning something useful. Anyways, today we're gonna be uh, solving this math equation. So let's say that a girl named Lily, that's my name. <laughs> Oh, really? Anyways, 
let's say Lily has 9,000 Gucci bags and then she bought 10,000 more Gucci bags. How many does she have now? She has 19,000 Gucci bags. Wrong! But that's correct. You know, no, 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 no. You're very, very wrong. The answer is not enough. <laughs> she needs more Gucci bags. Do you get it, kids? Uh, no. <laughs> what? Math isn't that hard. Anyways, let's uh, solve another math equation. A very, very, very simple one. So let's say that me, Brittany, bought 30,000 Chanel bags. <laughs> what? And then my friend Cherry wants to borrow two Chanel bags. How many Chanel bags do I have now? Hmm, is it 29,998? Wrong! What? I'm sure that's correct. No, it's not. <laughs> you never... <laughs> You never lend your Chanel bags to your friends, especially a girl named Cherry, ew. So the answer is never. <laughs> Does that make sense? Kids, do you understand? Uh, no. What? Are You seriously can't understand? I made it so easy for you kids. You still can't understand? Okay, let me try one more math equation. This is gonna be very, very, very easy. <laughs> so let's use another example. Let's say that my friend Vidya has 10,000 Versace dresses and then I asked if I can have 9,000 of them how much does Vidya have left um yes what's the answer is it 1,000 1,000 is your answer yes I'm sure it's correct. Do you want to know if you're correct or not? Well, guess what? You're not. So the answer is... <laughs> so the real answer is you never ask from your friends because that will make you look poor. Ew, disgusting. <laughs> so what is the correct answer? Buy your own. There, that's the correct answer. So do you kids understand? You understand, class? I told you math is so easy. <laughs> that's why I'm a math teacher. Teacher. So, do you kids understand? No? And she got mad. Seriously? Um, are you actually teaching us or are you just trying to flex? I am not flexing! You haven't seen me flexing, child! And then the whole class got scared. <laughs> Gosh, this class! Ugh, I can't handle it anymore! You kids are a pain! You can't even understand such simple math equations! Gosh, I'm leaving! <laughs> Girl! What? Well, what's wrong? I'm angry! Why? Because the kids are so dumb. What did you teach them about? Math. Well, yeah, it makes sense. Math is hard. But I made it so easy for them to understand. What did you teach them about? Very simple math. Oh, forget it. I'm angry, girl. Okay, one of you go teach them right now. Wait, what? Yes, hurry up. Go there. Um, okay. I guess I'm gonna be teaching them. Boy, Cassidy, where are you going? I'm just gonna teach the kids. Well, in that case, would you like me to uh, take you there and might as well hold your hand? Um, no. <laughs> oh, okay, okay then. <laughs> you can hold my hand. What? No, I'm not holding your hand. Chill, I was joking. Gosh. Uh, I guess I'm gonna go inside. <laughs> I'm kind of scared. Oh, uh, hello, class. Uh, my name is Cassidy, or you can just call me, uh, Miss Cassidy. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and I am your, let me guess, a new substitute teacher for a day. Yes. <laughs> Uh, oh my gosh, I feel nervous. This is the most screen time I get. Okay, so, uh, what are you gonna be teaching us, Miss Cassidy? I'm gonna be teaching you a different language. It's actually my own native language. Ooh, cool. So what is it? So today we're gonna be learning, uh, some Japanese. Ooh, wow. I have always wanted to learn a new language. This class seems fun. This seems fun. So... Uh, as you all know, uh, hello in Japanese is konnichi. <laughs> Can you say konnichiwa like this? Konnichiwa. Just say it. It's very easy. Uh, konnichiwa. <laughs> what? Um, you almost got the pronunciation right. Um, anyways, we're gonna be moving on. <laughs> we're gonna be continuing our lesson. If you have any questions, just tell me. Uh, what is cat in Japanese? Oh, well, I'm glad you asked. Cat in Japanese is...
is uh, there we go is neko say neko uh neko um i guess i can accept that i have no idea what to do now i feel so awkward this class seems boring oh uh, no 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 it's not boring uh how do i make this class fun um oh wait i know uh let's have a little quiz all right what does this say i don't know well it this says ah uh, say ah uh. why it sounds like a mother asking their baby to say ah uh. no 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 it's not like that just say ah uh. there it's right there say ah uh. ah uh. yes that is correct wow i'm actually doing something for once so what exactly are you doing um i'm teaching you to say ah uh. yes <laughs> um okay this is the most awkward class ever it's actually more awkward than that weep guy <laughs> what we guy are you talking about the one with the blue hair oh i see <laughs> anyways okay moving on let me just write this all right what does this says it looks like a nose no 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 is it nose in japanese no 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 no. it's not this says e i thought it's i <laughs> no 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 now say e why no not why e it's right there e um why okay i don't know what to do with you <laughs> okay can anybody else say e e okay good good you actually listen to me <laughs> i'm learning nothing at all <laughs> i thought it would be fun like i said this is the most screen time i get so uh, i'm getting nervous i'm not sure what to do do now i'm just gonna leave bye i feel so awkward <laughs> hey why are you back so early uh teaching is not for me i thought i could teach them my native language but it appears that i'm wrong so uh i'm just a lousy teacher <laughs> i'm just gonna sit right here okay anyways video you haven't been teaching the kids no <laughs> come on don't be shy i'm not shy i just don't want to teach the kids come on don't be shy just go go and uh fine hello <laughs> hello oh gosh what are you guys looking at i know i'm pretty but you don't have to stare at me so anyways what's up class my name is vidya don't call me miss vidya call me queen vidya or even better goddess vidya <laughs> if you think goddess vidya is a little bit too much just call me queen vidya i won't mind anyways today we're gonna be learning history yay all right Let's start. So during 1st May, <laughs> 1336, nothing happened. <laughs> and then 2nd of May, 1336, nothing happened. <laughs> and then the 10th of October, 1538, can you guess what happened? That's right, nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> a few hours have passed. All the students are sleeping. <laughs> All right. During October 8, 2005, it was the most amazing day ever. Why? Because I was born. <laughs> History is made. And October 9, 2005, it was even better. Why? Because I became one day old. <laughs> and then during 23rd of October 2005, I learned how to crawl and walk. That was the moment of my life. Yay. Hey, wake up. Wake up. Wake up, everyone. Wake up. I said wake up. Bonk, 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 bonk. Wake up. Up. Why were you guys sleeping? This is very, very, very interesting. I don't understand why you guys are sleeping. Gosh, is my lesson that bad? Wow. You know, you could have told me that my lessons were boring. Uh, your lesson was very, very boring. How dare you? <laughs> uh, I don't want any trouble. Uh, your lesson is so good. Why were you sleeping then? Your lesson was like a relaxing lullaby. Oh, I know. Okay, back to my lesson. <laughs> and during this day august 19 2023 it was the most magical day of my life why because i met a handsome fine pretty beautiful young man i have met my true love and what was his name elijah tihi <laughs> and then they all got uh sick ew who said ew who said that not me oh okay <laughs> and during september 16th 2023 it was even more magical than the day i first met 
my true love. Why was it way more magical? Because me and Elijah went out on our very, very first date. He, I was so in love and I was so embarrassed. Yeah. <laughs> and Jerry came in. <laughs> that was not a date. Hey, get out. You're interrupting my class. You get out. You're not even teaching the kids. Oh my gosh. Go away. I bet you kids met her already. Was she annoying during class? I know, right? I am not annoying. These kids actually enjoyed my lessons. I'm like yours. <gasps> How dare you. <laughs> get out of my class. You get out. You're not even teaching them. I'm teaching them about my history. My magical history. That's something very important. It's very, very useful. How is it useful? I don't know, but they still have to learn it. Anyways, get out. Fine. <laughs> Anyways, I'm bored now, so bye. <laughs> okay, I'm done. I can't I can't teach you kids. You're not even paying attention. Ugh. All right, I'm back. What were you thinking? What? I'm just teaching them about my magical history. <laughs> How is it magical? Because I was there. Duh. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, one of you go teach them right now. Wait, what? Go teach the kids right now. All you do is just sit there and do nothing. What am I supposed to teach? I don't know anything you useful like video hey that was useful <laughs> shut up um i guess i'll teach the class now <laughs> um cassidy you're not gonna wish me a good luck what no but i <laughs> you know what never mind all right hey class <laughs> you can just call me mr max and i am your new substitute teacher for a day yes <laughs> so today we're gonna be learning about geography wow something useful yay so today we're gonna be learning about a very very beautiful and fancy elegant and romantic country called France <laughs> they speak the language of love which is pickup lines that's where they invented the pickup lines let me go write it down pick up lines <laughs> what are pickup lines? Good question. Pickup lines are used when you're trying to flirt with someone. You sure this is geography? Uh, yes, yes. <laughs> We're learning about, uh, France. Um, okay. So the very first pickup line goes like this. Are you French? Because I fell for you. What? You guys don't get it? Um, no. But you don't, you guys don't get it? You don't get the I fell for you part? No. Because I said Eiffel, you know, Eiffel Tower from Paris, France. Oh, I get it. So that's how you do a pickup line. You can even use it to impress your little crush. Oh, really? Will it work? Sure. Do you have a crush? Uh, maybe I do. Is she in the class? But no. Well, do you want me to teach you some? Um, uh, maybe. Okay. Yay. <laughs> so now we're gonna be learning more about pickup lines. How is this useful? It's very useful, especially for the ladies. Anyways, the next pickup line goes like this is your name google because you're the answer to everything i'm searching for i don't get it Be because you know google when you search something you don't forget it <laughs> anyways the next pickup line goes like this can we stop learning about this please can we learn something more useful what are we gonna learn actual geography geography yeah you said we're learning about geography uh are we really yes Oh, well, I know nothing about geography. Um, I guess class dismissed. Bye. <laughs> Um, so what happened? Things weren't going as planned. I'm not surprised. What did you even teach them about? Geography, I think. What kind of geography? France? I teach them about France. Yeah, you know, the country. That's it. You sure you weren't teaching them about your pickup lines? Well, no, 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 I'm not. <laughs> Don't lie. I know you were teaching them about pickup lines. Um, I was just trying to help them to, uh, you know, impress their, their little crush. How is is that even useful? It's useful. I use it. Use it on what? You, you know, to you. What? But it never worked. I never fall for it. All right. I'm just gonna sit down. All right. So who's next? <laughs> we have one more. I guess it's you. What's your name again? Cherry. You know me when I Cherry was created. Oh, wait, I did? Yes. Wait, uh, are, are you Sam? No. Oh, uh, Mike? No. <laughs> oh, I remember. Finally, about 
of time. Jerry! What? Are you perhaps my long lost brother? What? No! <laughs> you really don't remember? Yeah, I don't. And Chris! You don't remember? Oh, right! Chris! Chris yeah. Jenner? No! Okay, whatever. Just go and teach the kids. Oh, okay. Uh, hello, children. My name is Chris. You can call me Mr. Chris. Okay. What are we learning about today, Mr. Chris? They were gonna be learning about music. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. This seems fun. Yes, music is indeed very, very fun. Um, this is also the most screen time I get. So, first things first, we're gonna be learning uh, about Do Re Mi Fa Sol La Ti Do. <laughs> so, it starts like this Do. Say Do. Say Do. You sure that's Do? It looks more like Do. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's not what I meant. Anyways, let's just uh, move that aside. Now, we're gonna be learning about different types of notes. So can anyone tell me what this is called? Uh, swirly whirly? What? No. <laughs> is it a snake? No. Where do you even come up with that? Oh, I know. What is it? Please know the answer. Please say the correct answer. Is it a, is it a rope? Oh my gosh. No. This here is called a G-clef. What is that? A G-clef. <laughs> that does not answer my question. Anyways. Okay, uh, can anyone tell me what note is this? <laughs> Uh, are you sure that's a note? It looks like the letter D. No, 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 it's not the letter D. Can anyone guess what note is this? I don't know. <laughs> is it a stick with a ball? No, no, it's not. This is called a crotchet. What is that? This thing. The one you're seeing right now. Oh, okay. Anyways, moving on. Just at this. This is just like the crotchet, except it has this little uh, tail <laughs> right behind it. So can anyone tell me what this is called? I have no idea. Uh, I got nothing. Wow, you really don't know. Yes, we don't know. This here is called a quiver. I'm not sure if I pronounced it correctly. Now, I want you to guess what note this is. <laughs> it looks like the crotchet that you were talking about. Yeah, it, it is, but except it has the hole in the middle. So what is it called? A crotchet with a hole. No, 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 it's not. A crochet donut. What? No, no. Where do you even come up with these answers? No, this is called a minim. What is that? This thing, you're looking at it right now. Oh, okay. And then Cherry comes back. All right, that's enough. Your screen time is over. You can go back now. What? But I was having so much fun. Really? You are? But your screen time is over. Remember, you're an underrated oh. character. You're so underrated that we even forget your name. So yeah, just get out. Oh. Okay. Okay, bye class. You can go home now. Bye. <laughs> oh, finally, it's home time. Yay. Can't wait to play video games. And then someone else showed up. Wait a minute. Wait, no, class is not over yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> no, it can't be! Hi, kids! You really think that class is over? Oh no, 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 no. No, my students, no. It's not over yet. You know what time is it? Is it time to go home? No! You're wrong. You get an F. What? Just kidding. Anyways, what time is it? It's joke time, of course. Yay! Alright, first joke. Then they all got sick. Yay. <laughs> Which school supply is the king of the classroom? I don't know. A ruler. Ah get it? Get it? Because I actually don't know how to explain the joke, but I'm sure you guys get it, right? Yeah, we get it. Okay, so laugh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Alright, second joke. No. And then Cherry comes in. <laughs> What's with all the noise? I thought the kids left. <laughs> <gasps> oh no! <laughs> Wait a minute! Jerry, is that you? I heard that you're a substitute teacher here. Is that true? Uh, yes. Oh, that's great! Well, why don't you stay here for a little longer so that you can listen to my jokes? Yay! <laughs> but I don't wanna. Come on! Just stay here, please, please. Um, okay. All right, more jokes. Yay! No. Well, guys, this video is actually way longer than I expected. But thankfully, it's over now. Yay! So anyways, that's all the time we had for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you do, please give this video a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. And turn on the bell so that you won't miss any awesome videos. Like this video. Subscribing really helped the channel. And thank you so much for staying till the end of the video. You guys are awesome. And thanks for watching. See you on my next video. Bye.